and kind of how it came about um, began probably in 2019. Um, I think I've told part of this story before, but I was in Florida uh, visiting. Uh, my parents lived there and uh, my family was getting ready to go into a, an, uh, an intervention for my dad. He was struggling with, with alcohol and um, it was really heavy. Um, I was sitting in my car and just crying out to God and was just desperate. Just saying like, Jesus, we need you. I knew that there was no other way for breakthrough to come but Jesus. Um, and as I sat in my car, uh, the Lord just kind of gave me uh, these, these words and melody to kind of just express this prayer and this desperation for him. And it kind of became this song that I would sing over my dad uh, over the last few years. And uh, a couple of years ago, uh, this song kind of became uh, something else to me as well. Uh, became a song I would sing over my son. Um, in, in 2021, um, my son uh, was born a few weeks early. Um, about six weeks before his due date, we, uh, my wife and I went to the hospital early in the morning, probably 3.30 in the morning. We just knew something was wrong. We needed to get, get it checked out, make sure he was okay. Um, and we get to the hospital and my wife uh, is about to go back and and I couldn't go back with her because I had COVID at the time. They said, you know, you can, you can wait in your car. So that's what I did. Um, and the doctor called me, he said, hey, it's not looking good. We need to deliver this baby right now. Uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna take your wife for an emergency C-section. And I'm sitting in that same seat where Jesus gave me that song. Um, and not having anything else to do, I, I drove home. Um, I wouldn't hear for a little while. So I went home and I, I just wept at home. I didn't know what was going on. Um, and uh, I just, I said, God, if I can worship you in joy, I'll worship you in sorrow too. And so I started singing that song, Jesus bring breakthrough over my son and my wife. And I said, oh, I need you. I said, oh, how I trust you. And I had to say that again, God, I trust you. Do I really trust you with my son? And what God showed me is that what we bring to him in desperation, um, he's gonna ask for and surrender. I had to surrender it. I said, Jesus, I trust you. I need you and I trust you. It's the two parts of that, the chorus that I had written a couple years before that. And uh, man, I can stand up here and I can praise God because uh, my son's healthy and he's a miracle and he's probably back here somewhere. Um, <laughs> We'll keep him up past bedtime for church. That's okay. Um, but I just think in this moment, as we go into this song, um, if there are those things on your heart that you know you need Jesus for, you say, Jesus, there's no other way. Just have a heart of humility and know as you offer that to him, he's also gonna ask for your surrender. So just right now, just begin to just bring that to mind. Just begin to surrender those things and let this song be a prayer and a cry for you. And if you're in a place of victory right now, just sing it over the people around you, the people in your life that you know need it.
through. 